So I just got asked by Alice a really good question on Instagram, which is, should I be focusing on social media or setting up a sales funnel to get clients for her online coaching business? Now you've probably seen the results of the other coaches being able to get quick results. And that was say, Samuli, he just signed on over 40 high ticket online clients. Adam just did a $12,000 launch. He only started a few weeks ago. And there's Aaron, which actually did over $137,000 just last month as well. So when it comes to being able to get clients quickly and to be able to build your online coaching business, I want to show you what it is that you need to be doing now because I see a lot of coaches getting swept up trying to put too much of their attention on creating content on Instagram, Facebook and YouTube as well and it could be completely wasting your time. So to make this really practical for you, I'm actually gonna change my phone for my iPad and I'm gonna show you what the money map is at the end of the day. Because the money map is one exercise I work through every single client when they come on into the Coaches Cartel program. And I wanna walk you through this right now because this is the four exact steps you can have set up right now to be able to make sure that you're actually building a business that gets you earning the money that you want, helping the people that you want, and living the life that you want all at the same time. So the money map is broken down into four key things for you to be able to do. And I'll be able to actually pop up this document in the blog post that comes with this video. So the four things is traffic source. How are you actually generating traffic? How are you getting people your message? How are you getting your message out in front of the people that you want as your clients? Number two is the relationship builder. And we can call this a lead magnet. Now, I don't want you to get caught up thinking a lead magnet's gotta be some sort of like 30, 50 page ebook or something like that. That's not the case. And I'll shoot a future episode in how to actually create a lead magnet that gets you clients quickly. But the third factor in the money map is actually conversions. How are you actually turning a lead into a client at the end of the day? And then fourth is a follow-up system. And this is what so many trainers and coaches simply do not have in place, because let's be perfectly honest, the people that land on your sales page or your sales video or see that you are selling something or your coaching programs, they're not gonna buy you the very first time. So you need a system, you need a process in place for you to be able to follow back up with them because the vast majority of the time it's the follow-up process that is actually going to be bringing the majority of your clients. So if we just focus on the very top one for now and that is the traffic source. Now a lot of people are going to think okay well traffic source maybe it's going to be YouTube, maybe it's Facebook, maybe it's Instagram, maybe it's all three of them. Now the problem is if you're just putting content out the whole time and it could be really good content you can get into a problem that I call the friend zone and that is people seeing your content, seeing your stuff and loving it but the problem is is they're not actually becoming your client. The big factor, and the truth is at the end of the day, you've got a lot of competitors. Like one simple swipe through Instagram and there's more online coaches or online trainers than you can poke a stick at at the end of the day. So how is it that you separate yourself from your competition? Well, you need to be able to have all four steps of your money map in place to be able to make that happen. And that's why to really come and actually answer Alice's question, because Alice, that's a great question that you ask. Should you be focusing on social media or sales funnels, I actually think you need to be focusing on the funnels first. In the point that you need to be able to have the method, the strategy, the process in place, so once you start bringing in leads, you're able to convert them. Otherwise, you get in that friend zone problem. So it's not an either or situation. It's really, you need to be working on them in the right process. You need to be able to prioritize and set up the process that's gonna get you clients, then the content that you put so much hard work into is actually gonna be doing its job. Because let's be perfectly honest, if you're wanting to just to churn out content like so much, maybe you're seeing heaps of like Gary Vee and you're saying that's absolutely amazing. Like I'll be perfectly honest, Hanson, the videographer that's behind the camera right now, if I had to have him following me around my life all day, every day, that becomes really expensive because I'm gonna have to put food on his plate and I've gotta make sure he's got a place to sleep the whole time. And the other thing as well is I've got a bunch of other things I need to be doing to be able to build my businesses and have all of my clients super happy be getting results rather than me just in front of the camera the whole time. So you need to be able to think of what is it in all the different things of your business right now that you need to be able to focus on. And if you're just pumping out content, and let's be perfectly honest, are you getting clients from social media right now? Are you getting leads and are you converting them? Because if the simple answer is no, it's time to change. And that's exactly why I wanted to share this episode with you right now, because it's the simple frameworks that can get you doing what it is that you need to do. And to make 
is really simple. What I'll do is I'll pop a link below for you to get access to the framework so I can show you what it is to be able to make sure that you've got a sales funnel in place and the content that you're actually creating is doing its job at the end of the day. Plus, if you wanna be able to know how to actually start running Facebook or Instagram ads, or to be able to make sure that you're actually scaling your business bigger and better, then I'll make sure that you get the case studies as well. So just click the link below, get access to it and chill out. It's completely free and there's nothing to buy in it as well. So I want you to use it, abuse it, see the results for yourself. And I'm looking forward to seeing you on the inside. Now, this is where I wanna make sure that you get the most out of being here and I wanna hear from you. So if you've enjoyed this episode, click like and make sure I can send you the new episodes each and every week. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Also, I really wanna make sure that I'm giving you exactly what you need. So comment below. I wanna know what you're gonna take away from this episode. And the best conversations after every episode always happen in the breaking system. Success Tribe. I'll pop a link below for you to join the free group so you get access to the guides, the live streams. I'm in there answering your questions personally each and every day, plus you get all the episodes as well. So thank you so much for being here and joining us. I'm really looking forward to seeing you in the next episode.